You can use Soundtrack Pro to slow down a clip without changing its pitch. First, let me play the original clip. From the time the run came in until we got the victims out was approximately 32 minutes. Uh, that's an excellent time and it just shows how good uh, a specialized rescue team we got and how good a fire department we have. Next, let's slow it down. Click on the speed tool within the tool palette. Grab the edge of the clip to extend its duration. This will slow down the clip with its corresponding audio. If you play the clip, you'll notice the pitch has changed. From the time the run came in until we got the victims out was approximately 32 minutes. Uh... This time, I'm going to slow down just the video portion of the clip by holding down the Option key while I extend it. Right click on the clip and take note of its new duration for the video portion. In this case, it's 14 seconds. Continue down the menu and select Send to Soundtrack Pro Audio File Project. Soundtrack Pro will create a new audio file project that you need to save. Within Soundtrack Pro, double click anywhere between these in and out points. Navigate to the process menu and select time stretch. Within the dialog box, change this pull down menu to drop frame timecode. Type in the new time value that matches the duration of your clip within Final Cut Pro. Navigate to the File menu and select Save. You can now go back to Final Cut Pro. Activate the Selection tool. Hold down the Option key to drag out the audio track to match the length of the clip on the video track. Notice how the speed of the clip has changed without changing the audio pitch. From the time the run came in until we got the victims out was approximately 32 minutes. Uh, that's an excellent time and it just shows how good uh, a specialized rescue team we got and how good a fire department we have. For other great tips and tricks like these or to enroll in a Final Cut Pro training course, visit GeniusDV.com.